How's it going everybody? Too Spooky here, and today I'm finally bringing you guys one of the most anticipated videos of all time. A video that was only whispered about in Legends. Today, we are going to be counting down 10 facts about the Rubik's Cube. This video was suggested by a handful of different people over time. These ones here are just a couple of them, but the only reason that this video now exists is thanks to Jack Hedge. Jack over here has been suggesting this video with some sort of witty comment on almost every single video I've made for over a year now. That is some serious dedication. Now I honestly wasn't sure if I would ever actually make this video, but I figured since Jack has been so dedicated to the cause, it's finally time we make this video happen. So thank you so much for all of those suggestions, Jack, because this video is going out to you, and you alone. But without further ado, make sure to grab a Rubik's Cube, and let's just jump right into this one, shall we? Number 1 The Rubik's Cube was first created in 1974 by Enro Rubik who was a Hungarian schoolteacher at the time. He originally created the puzzle out of wood as a challenge for his students. And after his students became very fond of the puzzle, Rubik decided to market it to a wider audience, where it eventually became known as the Magic Cube in Hungary. That was of course until 1980 when Rubik made a deal with the Ideal Toy Company, and then it finally became known as the Rubik's Cube. It would then end up instantly becoming a huge success even winning multiple awards the same year of its release alone. Number 2 Even though Rubik himself was the creator of the puzzle, he admitted in an interview that he wasn't very good at it compared to other people. It apparently took him over a month to complete it the first time, even though he had been messing with it pretty much every day. And these days it still takes him usually over a minute to complete it. Whereas some people out there in the world have some insanely fast times, but we'll get to those later. Number 3 Apparently, in 1982, Rubik's Cubes were a potential health risk, which was because of the colors on the sides of the cube, specifically the yellow ones, because apparently these colorful squares contained unsafe traces of lead, which was much more lead than the safe amount. So they then had to be recalled and fixed up before they could be re-released without any health risks. Number 4 one of the more little-known facts about the Rubik's Cube was that it apparently had its own animated TV show? Because the cube was so popular at the time, ABC ordered a full 13-episode animated season revolving around the cube which was called Rubik the Amazing Cube, which featured the Rubik's Cube with legs and a face that also had magical powers. So, yeah, that's a thing. Number 5 Rubik's Cubes are actually the best-selling toy of all time, having sold well over 350 million of them to date. Number 6 Back in 1995 to celebrate the 15-year anniversary of the Rubik's Cube, Fred Kueller, who was the CEO and founder of Diamond Cutters International, decided to create something called the Masterpiece Cube, which is essentially a fully functional Rubik's Cube that was crafted completely out of 18 karat yellow gold, and a variety of different gemstones for the colorful pieces, such as amethyst, rubies, and emeralds. This Masterpiece Cube took over 8,500 hours to create, and it is currently valued at 2.5 5 million dollars, making it the most expensive puzzle in the world. Number 7 The current smallest Rubik's Cube that is fully functional was created by Tony Fisher, and you can find a link to his video about it in the description. But the Rubik's Cube he created is only 5.6 millimeters long. This record has not been beaten yet from what I could find at least, but before Tony's there were multiple other tiny cubes differing by only a few millimeters each, all of which are fully functional. Number 8 now, although Tony Fisher created the smallest Rubik's Cube, he just happens to also have created the world's largest Rubik's Cube, and even has the Guinness World Record to prove it. 
coming in at 1.57 meters long, wide, and tall, or 5 feet 1.7 inches long, wide, and tall. And this one is also fully functional, although it's rather hard to move because it weighs in at around 100 kilograms, or 220 pounds. Number 9. The record for the fastest Rubik's Cube completion time is a record that has been beaten many times, and is still being beaten to this very day. In fact, there's even a chance, depending on when you see this video, that the record has been broken yet again. However, the current record holder as of making this video is Felix Zemdegs, who was able to complete the cube in only 4.73 seconds, which is also only 0.01 seconds from the previous record. Oddly enough, Felix also has the fastest record for the 4x4x4 cube, the 5x5x5 cube, the 6x6x6 cube, and the 7x7x7 cubes as well. So he currently has the fastest completion time for all five of the main Rubik's Cube counterparts. Now that is some real talent right there. And the moment that you've all been waiting for... Number 10. There are over 43 quintillion possible configurations or movements that can be made on a Rubik's Cube. Which is honestly a number I didn't even know existed until I was researching for this video. But the exact number of possible movements is 43 quintillion, 252 quadrillion, 3 trillion, 274 billion, 489 million, 856,000 possible movements. And holy shit, that is a lot. And if you were to try and make every single one of these possible configurations, moving the cube once per second, it would take you over 1,400 trillion years to complete every single movement possible which is actually more time than the universe has existed. But there you have it everybody, 10 facts about the legendary Rubik's Cube. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today and hopefully you learned something new. If you did, make sure to drop a like. But that's not all, if you leave a like on this video, there is a 10% chance that you will someday be able to complete one of these puzzles. The chances of this are much better than our usual offers, so this is one you definitely don't want to miss out on. Also, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on the next video, and while you're at it, feel free to follow my social media. You can find all those links in the description. <sighs> now then, Carl is taking a really long ass time to get Tali out of bed, so I should probably go see what the hell is going on. <laughs>
So just so everyone is clear... What do you mean by everyone? I'm the only one here. Alright, be quiet for a second. Okay, just so everyone is clear, Bane's adventure is going on hiatus for the time being. I apologize for any inconvenience, and I hope you all can understand. I... I'm honestly very sorry. Seriously, who the hell are you talking to? Alright, Too Spooky, off to your new temporary timeline you Wait, go. Wait, what? <laughs>